Um, okay. There we go. We're gone. Okay. So over right. to the island, I take it. Yeah, I'm. I'm already. I'm already looking for that. There you go. You've gone live. Right. I'm, I'll stand up. Yeah. Yeah. So. Right. So I've already gone to the boat. Uh, the ship that's buried beneath the sea or the magpie's wing. You wanna? Can you see where I am? I think you went off to the. Oh yeah, I can now. Yeah. I thought I was there, but I couldn't quite make out. So the magpie's wing is down here, just off the shelf. Uh, and what? the journal is in here somewhere that tells us which island the shroud breaker is on. Okay. Uh, it's in the captain's cabin, and it is there. Got it. So, yeah. If we take that back to the surface, it'll tell us where what island we're going to. <laughs> Um, I say it tells us it will be a picture of the island, and we're going to have to recognise it on the map. Um, apparently, Chloe said there's something shiny on the other island to look at, so... Okay, we are supposed to be blitzing this, though. This one here. Burning Blade, okay. The Burning Blade is gaining... Right, okay, so... Right, this is now we have to follow a path. Okay. So I'm gonna I'm gonna use the map and you're gonna read the clues to me and we're gonna work out where to go. Okay. Um it starts so at Discovery I... Ridge. I need to work out where Discovery Ridge is before we do anything else. Right, the south Discovery side Ridge. Discovery Ridge. Yep. Right, I've got Discovery Ridge. Read the clues to me, please. Okay, so it says, uh, anchoring down on the south side of Discovery Ridge, captain's gone yep. ashore. Mm -hmm. The burning blade, we are fleeing to the east, they are trying to pursue. Yep. Past a fortified island to starboard, and mending Lost north. Lost Gold Right, they're now heading north. Uh, okay. Then, uh, throwing the chest overboard south of a small island, plotting new heading east. Passing a chain of islands, burning blade following, maintaining course northeast to lure them away. But they so they threw. Is, whoa, 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 whoa! They threw the chest overboard. At south of a small, a small island. Chicken Isle. Okay, plotting new heading east. Yeah, they then carried on without the chest, which I don't think really matters to us. All we're worried about is where that where chest the, is. The chest yeah, the burning blade is going there. We'll soon catch. Yeah, all we need to do is get to chicken arc because we're not bothered what what happened to the burning blade. We need that chest. Um, okay, so the chest contains. Yeah. yeah, the chest contains a key and some more clues. The clues will tell us what island the shroud breaker is on. The key okay. will unlock the vault that it's in. But once the vault is open, we then have to do a puzzle uh, and. Um, it's behind. It's in a. It's in a like a safe in the in there. Um, so where are we at the moment? We are. Oh shit! We have to head basically west, don't we? I didn't realise you'd start moving. Um. Yeah, southwestish. In fact, that's spot okay. on now. What's it? It'll have. Port the damned on the right. We need to go. We might. It might be in our way, but as long as we just go around there, it's, it's in that rough direction. So yeah, basically, once we get to here and find the chest off the south end of the island, um, mm -hmm. it will give us like a little. Um, it will give us a key. Right. We then have to go. Um, to the island in the clues, it will be a an animal of some description uh, or an insect. Sorry, Andy, can I just stop you? Just stop you one second. Can we go in the Get my head down. Let me see. A head down. I'm going to turn the head down. Because that won't be too right. Mm -hmm. I don't know. 
Yeah, sorry, continue, Andy. Yeah. We'll pick up a little statue, which is a key. And okay. some more clues. The clues will take us to the island where the trail breaker is. The key opens the vault that it's in. And it's then in, like, a little rock safe inside the vault. And things suddenly got really misty. Yes, it has. There's an island passing very close to our... Oh, that's the fort. Yeah, fort the damned, I think. Yeah. This is the one you activate by getting all the different coloured flames. So you'll leave, leave the wheel. Can you leave the wheel in case I need to turn? What should I do? I moved this out of the way of it. And that's not where that's not where we're going. We're going to Chicken Isle, not not Snake Island. Chicken Isle is the other side of Snake Island. It's, oh, okay. uh, yeah. We're gonna have to amend our course to go west for a second. Tiny little thing that'll suddenly just jump out of the sea, I think. Far in. Yep. What's this headphones? I think that's it. It's quite funny playing with Dave and Sonny last night because Dave doesn't know his left from his right. <laughs> and Sonny was just constantly, he, he kept going on the wheel and uh, we're like, can you go left? So he starts turning right and you're like, no, left Dave, left Dave. <laughs> Everybody's left, not your left. Um. I think that is Chicken Isle. It is Chicken Isle. It is. Right, stand ready on the anchor. Yep. Right, uh, oh, just drop the anchor now. Drop oh, it. On, no. I'm trying to, I've just attached to it. Oh, no. Right. Yes. That was close. Sorry, my young one talked to me at the same time as you were.
Get rid of these little snackies. There we go, right. So, south side of the island. South side of the island, we are looking for a chest on the sea. I'll say there's a chest on the land here. No, chest, they dropped it in the sea. Yep. Okay. Remember the clue, it said they dropped it in the sea. Off the south coast of the island. We're looking for Back to the surface because I'm out of air. It's not going to be off the shelf, is it? Um, we found it really easily last night, but it was a different island. Oh, hang on, I see something. I see something. Where is it? I think I found it. Oh, I think I see it, yeah. Yep, found it. Right, get it up to the surface. Ancient chest, yes? Yep. Oh, well, it's right. We, we stopped virtually on top of it, look. See, you haven't got my blooming anchor copy skills. I know, it's another chest, but it's not going to go right now. Right, pop on the deck. So. Take the pages, they're the they're next clues, and that is the, the Scarab Totem. Yes, we're going to the same place as last night. Brilliant, that's what I wanted to see. Um, so we are going to... Um, uh, I've forgotten the name of the island, but I know where it is. Island of Tears. Okay. Looks a little bit like England. It is... Um, I want to say it's Lone Cove. No, it's Crooks Hollow. It's Crooks Hollow. Crooks Hollow. I'm going to have a look at the map. Look at the map. I can see it. I can see it east, yeah? Yep. Oh, look how close we are. It's the same island we had last night, but it can be different. Um, it can be different islands, but that's, that's handy. That's just giving us the same island last night. That is good news. We are going east. <clears throat> <coughs> Fallout 76 is on Game Pass, eh? Yes, it is, yeah. <sighs> For all your multiplayer. Post-apocalypse needs. Mm. Yeah, we can get this done easy. Is there a ship out in front of us? I can see a sail. But there is, yeah, that ship that we passed on the way in that hasn't moved or anything, so... Just check.
Our destination is right in front of us. Probably just fish with Jay Dog. Oh, oh, of course, it's Thursday. Ready on that wanker? Yep. Sorry, remember your kids are what listening, aren't they? Yep. <laughs> right, okay, drop it now. Drop it now, drop it now. <laughs> That'll do nicely. We're in the bay and we're ready to leave straight away. Look, how's that? Um, okay, so. Uh, we need to take the scarab totem with us. Maybe there, so I'll take that. <laughs> um, Come hither, dear boy. I'm going to show you secrets of the island. <laughs> This isn't your way of luring me into your sex dungeon, is it, Andy? Actually, I'm off. sorry, I've gone in the wrong hole. Oh, there's a um, I need to go into the cavernous one. <laughs> yeah. This one. <laughs> oh dear. It's an 18 plus stream, kids. Right. Okay, the vault is right here. Okay. This between the between the two scarab yep. pictures and the thing. Mm -hmm. uh, although we're going to get skeletons first. Right, right now. Oh, right. Yeah. Two down. Uh, there you go. I'm gone. Easy. Um, okay. So the key to unlock it. I've got the key in my hand. Look. Yep. He is here. Mhm. Mm and we're popping it on this square here. Oh yeah, that's it. And then the door will open. Ready? Oh, what ones are these? Oh. Right, now... This is where it gets a bit tricky. Alright? Right. Okay. Once we start the puzzle in here, mm -hmm. the room will start to fill with water. If we don't oh. complete it, we drown. Okay. Um... So I need you to read the clues to me. So in the book, if you look at the book. Yeah, give me a sec. Book, looking. Go to the last page, right? Um, there is a. Uh, there's. You need to read those clues to me. So it's basically the three people with a sword above their head. Yeah. Um, so the first, basically, we've got four columns here. Look. Once we start the puzzle, you can rotate the columns. All right, yeah. So you need to read out to me that it's Shroud Breaker, then the three people with the sword. Then the next clue is the three boats with the person holding the Shroud Breaker. Well, I've got, the three, last waves. I've got three waves is... before that. Oh, no, I'm with no, it. Yeah, no, I'm with it. Yeah, 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 that's, yeah. that's one line. That's okay, one okay. line. That's boats right. with the waves above it, right? Yeah. Uh, and, and then, then the third breaker. clue is the per yeah. with the family or whatever it is. So... Um, first thing we do is we light these braziers. So, uh, get your torch out. Uh, 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 Did I? 
Oh, yeah. Okay, there we go. Right, we're now locked in. Puzzle has started. So, every time I finish a, uh, a clue, you need to press this button here, okay? Button I'll tell you when there. to press okay. it. Okay, alright. This button here, enter okay. secrets, right? Yeah. Okay, so I think. Right, Shard so the first one was a shroud break, wasn't and it? three people with swords. Right. Shroud break, uh, one person with a sword, one person with a sword. Yep, hit it. Yeah. Okay, next one is three right. boats. Three boats and shell uh, shell breaker. With a person three No. Boats. Someone holding shell breaker, shall Person think. holding the shroud breaker. Yeah, yes. So it's three waves, then right. three, three boats. boats, person holding shell breaker. Yeah. Okay, hit it. Done. Okay, last one. So person holding shroud breaker and then three people worshipping. Yep. Yes. Oh, sugar. Yes. That was already... Three people worshipping, yeah? Three right. people worshipping. two... Right, I just need to change the last one by the looks yep. of it. Hit it! Done. Done it. Okay. Now, we need to find three medallions. Right three medallions go in these little... No, the three oh, medallions yep, go yep, in I'm these little it. circles here. Okay, yeah. Now, on, on here, it's now telling us where the first medallion is. So you, can you see the reflection in the water, or the picture yep. in the water? Yep. Now that scarab stone is right outside here. Okay. So that is here and the right, watch my back while I dig this up. So we're gonna get attacked. Yep. Right, I've got the first medallion. Gonna give me the same one again as last night. Yes, it is. Second one is out here to the right, and it is. I think it's here. There it is. Third one's a little bit trickier to find. Oh god, what are they? Like Davy Jones's dudes. Okay, right. Last one. Last one. Yeah. Uh, oh. Oh, uh, yes. Just give me the same one as last night. So, up on the top of the island, there's like an Easter, Easter Island looking funky sort of statue head thing. It's up the top of the island. Um, can't remember exactly when, but where. But if we get up high, um, we can soon find it. I think if we go this way. There's a path up on the top of the island this way somewhere. <coughs> we should. We'll get this done. We'll get this done in plenty of time for Dave and uh, Tonya to come online, hopefully. Hmm. Right, look for the statue head. Looks a bit like one of the Easter Island statues. It's toppled on its uh, sort of at an angle on its like left side of its face. It's not completely over it, sort of leaning on its chin sort of thing. Oh I think I remember where it is, it's up on the second ledge. Can you see the where it goes up again? Mm-hmm. Right behind you. I think it's up here and then you double back. Here it is. No, that's not it. Uh... There it is. Got it. Oh, I walked straight past it. Yeah, so it's... I think if we dig in front of it, roughly around here... It's here somewhere. It is definitely here somewhere. There you go. Got it. You've got it. You've got it. Got it. Running away. Yeah, they're trying to protect the medallions, and we get a load more of these when the, um... There we go. Yeah, so get back to that cave. 
wait for me to get down there, and uh, you'll be able to see what happens when you... Okay. I've done it several times, this is the third time I've done it. <laughs> um, luckily, every time it's given me this same island. Oh, hello. Gilded Chalice, we've got some free gold. And there's also a chest here as well. It's outside that main What's cave. Sort of chest? Food chest, I think. Just it's on the way to the back to the ship, so we've got on the way back to. Right, so, I'm wood crate back. with forty four fifty in. I am in the cave. Ah. Tell me when. Uh, to be honest, you can probably just do it. If you pop the last metal in uh, to the thing, it'll you'll see a little vault open at the back of the cave. Yeah. And then you can pick up the frag breaker. You need to pick it up and run like the path back to the ship. Here we go. Got it. Yeah, so just before you pick it up, you need to... Oh, you didn't do it. Oh, shit. You're supposed to replace it with a bag of sand and run away before the big golden stone ball comes from. Oh, really? Oh, no, that's Indiana Jones. Oh, are you it's <laughs> back. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, I've got I've got a gold chalice in my hand. But, um, it's a hard heart. <laughs> I said that to Dave last night. I said we've got to swap it for a bag of sand and then run away when the great big uh, stone ball comes at us. And he, he got it straight away. He's like, oh, brilliant! Yeah. Why do you think that was, that was the reference you're making? Okay. Yes. So yeah. Uh, it's basically just a case, if we put everything in the uh, in this chest, we can sell this little gold chalice that I picked up. You want me to put the trail break in there? Yeah, put, yeah, 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 yeah. yeah. Uh, um, and then, them. we're basically heading to any outpost. Uh, I can't find it, how can I get this from there? Ancient Spire outpost, you'll do. Yeah, hang on a second, I can't actually, find a trail no, breaker yeah. in my inventory. It's not in your inventory, it should oh. be in your hand. No, it's not, I pissed beat. Oh, I haven't dropped it, have I? You've dropped it. You've oh. dropped it somewhere. Fudge nuts, I know I know I dropped it, don't I? Yeah, right outside of the cave. <laughs> I won't forget her. Who? Where is that wood crate? Eh. Got it. Okay, let's try that again. Eee! Almost getting Yeah, last night we nearly had a massive disaster, and I'm talking massive disaster. Um, we sailed away from this island, straight into the middle of a load of barrels with stuff in. Unfortunately, one of the barrels was dynamite. Um, oh. Excuse me. So it took out me and... It killed me and Sonia and sunk the ship. So Dave was left alone on, the, on a sinking ship. Um, with the shroud break and all the jewellery we'd picked up, well, jewellery, all the gold and stuff we'd picked up. So, um, we had, we had to wait to spawn, right. for, um, to, for me and Sonia to sail back from him alone on a, on a, on a brig. Um, which we managed to do, but Dave was collecting everything up and putting it in the little rowboat that we'd managed to collect. Oh, right. <laughs> which is which comical, he was just bobbing about just off the coast of this island on a little, uh, in a little dinghy um, waiting for us to come and pick him up. It was... Luckily, we, we didn't lose everything. Right, I've just marked uh, an outpost on the map. Can you just give me a heading? I didn't, I didn't take note of correct. Uh, which one? I've got to... Uh, slightly more southwest. The ancient... Uh, this one here. Ain't... 
I marked one southwest for something. Yeah, that, yeah, that's the one. Yeah, you've marked another one. The one which has come from Chicago. Yeah, southwest. There's an island yeah, we're, we're away, to the past close mate. to us on our left-hand side. Is that Paradise where, Spring? Yeah, Thunder Eight Post. That's yeah. where we're going. Thunder Eight Post. Yeah. Yeah. Thunder Eight Post. Yeah. In fact, I can see it. Try it out in front of us. On. There you go. That, that that is what I mean. That that we we could speed speed run that bit. That is fairly straightforward, and it, it helped that we got the same clue as I got last night. It can be mm. one of six islands, and oh, every okay. time I've played this mission, I've had the scarab totem. Oh, okay. So it's been at it's been at that same island every time. Right, I'm going to break where once we go, go out and get. Oh no, I'll I'll wait to get the island. Right. Uh, we'll get the, uh... Yeah, because the, the stranger's going to talk to us when we get there. Alright, let me give get... him the trail okay. breaker. Alright, give me two seconds. I'm gonna and it'll tell us where... Okay. Whoa! And that's not a euphemism. I was uh, going to say, is that a euphemism? Yeah. So it's a moist. Is it a moist voice? A moist. moist <laughs> a moist reptile. <laughs> oh. <sighs> oh, that was fun. That's my exercise for the week. Right, we are coming up on our destination. The lucky thing is that the next part of the tray or the next part of the tray of gold actually launches from Thunder Eight Post, I think. He'll actually mm. tell us to go to Thunder Eight Post. Okay. Right, uh Yeah now. Right, just below, there's a wood crate. Can you pick that up, please? I've stuck it in front of the, I think it's in front of the grog barrel, next yep. to the, next to the, the prison crate, cell. Yep. 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 You bring that and sell that for the trader lady on the dock. I'll sell the gold chalice. Once you've sold that, we can speak to our dude. Anything you give want him the shroud breaker. Um, it's not giving me an option to sell. Ah, I hope yeah. I was helpful. Yeah, you've gone to the ship, right? I meant the oh. trader. This, oh, this, sorry. this one here. This one. Sorry. Yeah. Okay. Okay, yeah, so we have the Shroud Breaker. We're now going to give it to the mysterious stranger and he will tell us where to go next. He's also pretty much going to um, cream his pants over the fact that we found the Shroud Breaker because he didn't think he'd ever see it again. But there you go. Here we go. Great Ramsey's ghost. I heard all the stories, but to actually hold the Shroud Breaker in my hands, I never thought I'd see the day. Something's wrong. There should be four jewels set in the base that grant the Shroud Breaker its power, but they've been removed. Without them, you won't last five minutes in that fog. Now let me think. 
I did hear tell that Captain Briggsy made it to the shores of gold. If that's true, she might know the whereabouts of these missing stones. Not that she'd ever say. Sometimes, even the best pirates fall victim to their greed or hatred, and it changes them, strips the flesh from their bones, gives them power, but twists them up inside. Briggsy is one such abomination. People call them skeleton lords, and most pirates flee at their approach. Not even the Order of Souls dares challenge them, and rightly so, but you... You are going to have to hunt one down. I have eyes of and we are. ears across the Sea of Thieves. If you gather any of the missing pieces, I'll see they're restored to the Shroudbreaker on your behalf. For now, head to Plunder Outpost and speak with Madame Olivia about Briggsy's whereabouts. Remember, skeleton lords are not to be taken lightly. We we're at Plunder Outpost. So what we need to do is wait hopefully for Dave and Sonya to come online. And we take on uh, we go to Madame Olivia, which I believe is the lady in the Order of Souls tent in here. Here she is. Okay. We're not gonna do that yet, we're gonna see if Dave and Sonya can come on. Sending a message to Ziblops chat to see if him, uh, if you and Sonia can make it. Okay. Smoking at my hat. Huh? You seem to have smirked. I was awarded the Pirate Lord hat and I put it on. No. Well, I, had you I didn't <laughs> smirk. <laughs> I heard. I was no. At it. <laughs> I just sent Jamie a message last Saturday after you went offline. Just as you went offline, he sent me a message saying, Fancy a bump. Right. He was obviously shit faced, and that was when we started the party and had the discussion uh, that I told you about. Um, yes. Where his little problem had decided to rear up again, so to speak. Um, but that's his own luck, okay, he's not doing himself any fucking favours. Um, so I, I said, I, I, yeah, went in a chat with him. So I've just sent him a message just now saying, fancy a bum. There you go, he's got a reply. Cool, there's an offer. <laughs> yeah, he upset his little problem because uh, he decided to go, go into a party with me, uh, according to him. Said that uh, they got they got the got the slot because he decided to go into a party with me. Oh well. Ha ha ha. Shit happens and he die. Oh, are you still? Uh, is Dave? Has Dave heard anything about his um about his gig yet? No, yeah, I haven't spoken to him, so I, I wouldn't know. I won't know until maybe he contacts us to this eve. If he joins. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. 
Mm -hmm. I think this first one, it basically, we know, it, as as he said, uh, I, I can tell you roughly what happens without giving you too many spoilers. Um, if you step back to the ship, I shall show you. Um, I can't remember where it's going to send us, but I think we, we pick up clues. First of all, we speak to Madame Olivia here, um, and she will tell us what we're doing next. Um, but basically, we will sail around and do five missions over the course of um, X amount of times, okay? Mm -hmm. Four of the missions are to collect stones for the Shroud Breaker. The fifth is just a little bonus mission in the middle uh, to reunite the ghost. Uh, the, the ghosts of two dead lovers, okay. um, and that'll, that'll explain itself later on. Once the Shroud Break is complete, we will go to here, to the Devil's Roar, right. Morrow's Peak Outpost, and there's someone on the island, I think it's Grace, she stood just outside the pub. She can reassemble the Shroud Breaker. We then strap it onto our ship, and it'll strap on next to the wheel up up on the bridge. Mm -hmm. uh, and then we can sail north into the Devil's Shroud. Normally, mm -hmm. if we tried to sail into this bit, we would just sink. Right, okay. But with the Shroud Breaker on, although it'll be a little bit rough for a few seconds, we'll go through without getting any damage. Uh, we then carry on north, and I think the island is around... Y three around where the where the where the wording for the shores of gold is. Um, I think it's around there. Once you get there, uh, there are four puzzles. I think each puzzle gives us a medallion, so we'll need to carry a medallion each. The four medallions go into a lock. Um, you unlock that. And then you have to find your way through all the puzzles. A bit like, you know, when me, you and Kelly did that mission a few months ago. Yeah, yeah. Um, where there was all the traps and stuff like that. You have to go through a load of that kind of stuff. And then fight a really powerful skeleton lord at the end. Okay. Uh, once you beat him, you get his skull, which is worth, I think, about 10,000 gold. Uh, it might even be worth, worth, worth more than that. Plus a load of gold and bits and pieces that you can pick up as well. Right. So is. yeah, once you pick all that up, who's that one? Dave's online. Oh, is he? Mm -hmm. Oh, I've probably not got him marked as a favourite, so he doesn't come up to me. I'll probably mark him and Sonya as favourite, so I know when they come online. Yeah, that's yeah, that's what I thought. <laughs> I tend to keep the uh, the dudes on the phone with regularly. At the top of my friends list, so I get a ping when they come online. Let's do that. They're both online, actually. Friendship. Favorite. Right, so, yeah, we're going to need to drop back to the menu now. So if you just go... Actually, I'll invite them to the party first and just check that they're actually wanting to do this tonight. Straight past mine, we've got tons of time to be able to do it. Sonny's just started up Sea of Thieves, so I would take that they, as they being... Will be <laughs> oh, where the hell are they gone? I thought I'd just added them as friends, uh, as favourite. Yeah, let's drop... Yeah, let's go back to the menu, so leave game, uh, and I'll set up a galleon. Hello, hello. Hello, hello, hello. Hello, sexy people. 
if one's popping. Tell you what I might do, uh, James, if because um, they uh, Dave and Sonia are pretty much busy tomorrow, aren't you? Yeah. Well, the thing is, yeah, the thing is, well, no, uh, what I was going to say is don't don't worry about rushing home because um, Bilal sent me a message a little while ago saying, can I help them with a cocaine sale? And I said, well, we've kind of made plans to do Sea of Thieves, but the people I'm doing Sea of Thieves with are probably busy on Friday night, so I'm happy to do that then. So me, James, and Bilal... And Jamie, if he wants to join us, can do can do GTA tomorrow night, and then come back to see if thieves on Saturday. If you're free, then rather than make you rush back and whatever, don't worry about it. We'll we'll you know we we can do something else. It's fine. It's all good. It's all good in the hood. Um, right. So I'm firing up a galleon with a closed crew. In fact, I'll send Jamie a message and see if he wants to do GTA tomorrow night uh, with me, Bilal, and James. Where's, where is that, um, that handsome devil? Jamie Barnes, you handsome... Uh, you well-hung handsome... Oh, uh, what, are you talking to me again? <clears throat> no, Jamie. Oh, we... <laughs> <laughs> we need to add. Uh, uh, oh, he's yeah, on I, mine. I did invite. Yeah, uh, invite everyone to game. There we go. Uh, well, Pardon? That's a good trick. If you can do that, well done. <laughs> I've been trying to do that for years. <laughs> <laughs> um. <laughs> and on that note, how are you? <laughs> Um, <laughs> Take it to the bridge, brother. Take it to saying, the bridge. That, that, that's an entrance <laughs> and a half, literally, isn't it? Coming in and just saying, I ended myself. Literally, it's so impressive. <laughs> Are you sharing your oh. um, audio for my audience of one? Of course. I, I'm really sorry that first sentence was not included. Oh, <clears throat> I'm very disappointed. Never mind. <laughs> Never mind. Probably the injuring oneself. <laughs> yeah, you, you had your hands full. Hey. I get it. Yep. Yeah. My, my stream is again called, well, Wahey My Anchor. Wow. It should be, well, it should well, be. Wahey My Anchor. It should be, it should be, well, hello, Wah Anchors. <laughs> I, I did a gig at a yacht club and they were giving the prizes in their raffle were like t-shirts and um, and tea towels with W <coughs> and a picture of an anchor nice Extra Drive 100 terabyte solid state SSD from Nimbus has held the world record for the biggest solid state drive in the world for two years now and it costs forty thousand dollars. <laughs> We're missing Dave. Oh yes. Yep. 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 Did Dave's not. Oh, Dave's not coming. Apologies. I'll go and find my invites. Join. Oh, I can't. Just... You're in the wrong place. That's why. Oh yeah. Did you turn left instead of right, Dave? He doesn't know what he's doing. There's, there's something on your back. 
Is that is is that a, a Doctor Who thing? Didn't yeah. Doctor it is indeed. The yeah. The uh, the turn left. The episode was called Turn Left. Okay. Oh, it's brilliant that episode. It should be called um, Turn I, Left, Dave. I remember no, it. The other left. <laughs> I, re I remember it so clearly because um, during lockdown, a girl who works for Doctor Who magazine was organising um, lockdown watch parties on Twitter. Uh, and the, mm. the one that got the most views was um, the, it's, it's not the part of the ways, is it? The End of Time, part one and two. Where, yeah, okay. um, basically, everyone comes back and it's Davros. Uh, Davros is trying to destroy reality mm. and um, mm -hmm. all of that, all that's, of that jazz. That's, uh, that's, that's the, the second, second part of the three parts, isn't it? Yeah, um, well, basically, um, David Tennant joined the watch party. Uh, oh, wow, cool. his, missus, his missus was watching it. Um, uh, Captain Jack, what's his name, was, was watching it. Wow. Barrowman. Um, Barrowman. Yeah, Russell T Davies and Stephen Moffat signed up for Twitter just to do that. Uh, just <laughs> to do the watch parties. Um, Stephen Moffat has since left Twitter again. Um, and yeah, basically cast members, past and present, hundreds of them, uh, have, have come in and watched these lockdown things. But before That's that, one, I watched. I watched Turn Left first, uh, and then mm. watched second the the, the two parter. Yeah, and it, that one in particular was pretty special. I sat. I think it was a Friday night, and I sat here and I had a few beers, and everyone was fucking crying. It was. It was. John Barrowman yeah. even put a fucking uh, even put a video on Twitter just going in. You know, like in the middle of um, the pandemic and how horrible things are in the world right now. How brilliant it is that all of these Doctor Who, thousands of Doctor Who fans all over the world just got together on a on a hashtag on Twitter and just all chatted about the episode and watched it while people like David Tennant were actually there with us as well. It was all it was it was a little bit surreal and also really quite <laughs> touching as well. Amazing. It was really good those episodes then. <clears throat> The one I really wanted to watch, and I, and I missed it, was um, Zygon Invasion and the Zygon Inversion, which was the, the what, two the parts originals? The, no, the, no the, uh, the one with Peter Capaldi, um, the, the two part with Peter oh, okay. uh, Capaldi. Um, it was in the Black Archive and it was all around what had happened at the end of the, the 50th anniversary episode. Um, he'd mm. let the, the, uh, Matt Smith and David Tennant had left a really uneasy truce in place. Um, with the Zygons living among the humans, hidden as humans, um, mm. and the, the the peace was basically coming apart, um, and it all went a little bit uh, pear shaped. Right. Okay. So we are. Where are we? We are We're not at Plunder Outpost. We need to head to Plunder Outpost for the next part and of get the. Olivia. Yeah, Madam Olivia. Outpost. I'm not even in the game yet. Still in. <laughs> So I'm right, just can, stocking up. We can, yeah, we can stock up while you're, uh, while you're loading it. God, you uh, and your 1980s it. internet. Where's our ship? Oh, over Why there. Can you stick another 50p in your hamster? A tortoise. <laughs> that's, that's the front end, by the way. My tortoise doesn't. <laughs> my tortoise doesn't enter itself, you know. You. <laughs> 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 it literally does. <laughs> it actually, yeah, it can. From not not only can it enter itself, it can do it from five different places. Really? Um, yes. Well, that's just, well oh, yeah. Think about tail it. And head. Yeah. I'm, I actually don't know how big a tortoise outside of its shell is, so I don't know whether it's possible to crawl literally, through all the other. It's holes. about ninety-five percent of its entire body is its shell. Wow, cool. It's actually part of the body. They, it they're is. born with those shells, aren't they? Yeah. Yes, and it's been recently proven that they, they, um, but you know, like, um, used to basically drill a hole in the top of your tortoise and put a hook in it and a bit of string to keep it from running away. It's actually been right. proving oh. that they're, yeah, it's actually been proven that they can feel that because they thought it, because it sounds horrible that they didn't have any nerve endings in it, but they do. So when oh, your grandmother had a tortoise no. and drilled a hole into it to keep oh. it in the garden, Who it could actually the fuck feel did it. That? 
everybody because it was widely that. believed it was it was really widely believed that they didn't they didn't have any feelings there and it didn't hurt them have at you all. done that to herman we have not done it to herman Thank herman's God. crazy she'd pull out a flick knife and stab he has, he, he has played football <laughs> with it, no oh um, my God, i've got no I can't believe that that would ever be a thing. Yeah, yeah, yeah. No, Back I've never day. heard of that before. That yeah, yeah, people do it. Yeah, I swear to God. I, I, I think it was. I think it's actually quite a recent discovery that they actually have the uh, feeling in their shells. Because I think they just believe they didn't have any nerve oh. endings in it, and therefore couldn't feel I when you drilled into it. Never even considered drilling into anything that had a shell, whether they could feel it or not. Yeah. Yeah. Alright. There you go. That's that's your that's your lesson for the day then. From that's my imparted wisdom. It's really upset. Right, we're gonna, <laughs> tell you, yeah, we're gonna we're gonna have to start. We're sort of starting the movement here. Save the save the tortoise. Do you know what? When I was working in Blackpool, um, the, uh, the 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 owner of the club that I worked for was a right uh, I don't know right character I suppose in. Want for want of a did better you, term. Um, did you take them to, to one side and say, can I have a word in your shell like that? No, <laughs> I would have drilled into his shell, I tell you. <laughs> um, oh. he, um, he, he used to send round a, like, a, uh, like a charity pot uh, with a picture of hedgehogs on it saying that he was collecting for a hedgehog charity and he used to make right. us kind of advertise it and encourage people to put into it and whatnot, knowing that it was bollocks. It was just his way of trying to get more money and right. you you could the, the sarcasm in our voices when we were talking about this over the microphone was tangible <laughs> <laughs> i'm not sure why we got onto that subject because hedgehogs <laughs> have shells well definitely hedgehogs but definitely yeah i know I, I don't remember I don't remember. <laughs> what are we doing? Collecting <laughs> stuff. Who am I? Where are we? Why are we? Oh, that one—that one's a bit deep, isn't it? Yeah, we haven't got time for why. Forty-two. That's why. Yeah, I was gonna say I was waiting for waiting for that. To be fair, forty-two. <laughs> <clears throat> right. Okay. Uh, let's. Son, you can drive to me. No, thank you. On the right. That's right, Dave. She doesn't want to be left out. <laughs> I don't think Dave gets right, right, up, right arm, James. <laughs> <laughs> oh dear. Ah ha ha ha, James. <laughs> <laughs> Or is that the kind of sarcasm? <laughs> Am I supposed to donate to a hedgehog charity now? With that kind of sarcasm. <laughs> right, I'm just okay. practicing um, for laughing at your dad jokes next time I come and see you in one of your gigs. Yeah. Next time. Oh, speaking it's of gigs, it's what's, only been 20 years. Your, uh, what's happening with your Dire Straits one? <laughs> so, it's going on. Apparently, it's going to be outside. Awesome. Oh, right, okay. I'm not sure how that's going to work yet, uh, whether I'm providing PA and all that jazz, um, or whether it's even going to be moved inside after the government changed their stance on it. Yeah. Don't know Next yet, week. but it's going ahead. <laughs> well, I'm just glad going that outdoor gigs are, have been given the go-ahead. It's, it's given me a lease of life. Mm. I think our first one's going to be at least mid, mid August or late August, because <laughs> the first two we've got lined up, one is tiny and has no outdoor space. The second one has cancelled all live music until next year. <laughs> then oh, I was wow. due to go on holiday for a fortnight. <laughs> so it looks like it's going to be mm. mid-August. But well, I've heard are you, are you, are you, that some, some are not booking in any more uh, shows until they've rescheduled everything that they have for 2020 into 2021. That's fair. So enough. booking at the moment is really difficult. Mm. It's just a big waiting game. Yeah. We were lucky because our 2020 was right. quite busy. So if that happens with us, we'll be we'll be quids in for next year. I know a lot of our weddings. Oh, there we go. Right. Okay. Yeah. Um, guys, if we if, if we're navigating, um, I've marked map, um, and the hole. You look at the map is 
basically right in front of the captain's cabin. Yeah, so if it. you need to look at the map, then that's there. Uh, so do south yes. or south east, probably. So I'll make yeah, sure I'll I know because up. I won't be Morning driving, up, Sonia will be driving. Um, considering all of the advice that she was given last night was was coming from a place of, of expertise. <laughs> no, I'm not driving. I'll she drive. should drive and and demonstrate, really. And if you kids don't, okay, I was doing if it. you don't, kids don't behave, doing it turn the right. ship around right now. <laughs> I mean it. And you'll be going straight to your galley. Yeah. You, you go straight home and straight to brig. Straight to your, straight to your cabin. Right. I right. Hope. Okay. Um. So we need to get to Thunder Outpost, which I have already marked on the map. Um, we will then, uh, I think me and James have just done this, so the idea is we're going after Briggsy, uh, which was a, was a skeleton lord, I believe. Yep. Um, so if we can all get aboard, uh, the sails are down. Um, I'm in. James is driving. Uh, I'm not on the boat yet. roughly southwest. It's a ship. Yeah, I'm not going to bother doing... I'm, I'm not going to bother... Um, I'm not going to bother getting the anchor up yet. Oh shit, um, I'm in because, the water. Um, it, it needs three or four people to get it up with any kind of decent speed, basically. You can get pills for that now, if they're handy, to be fair. Yeah, no, my kind of orgy. You don't, no, you don't need three or four people to get it up. Just a blue pill. Right, um... Dave, can you give a hand on the anchor, please? Yeah. Dave! Yeah, he's... He's below decks. Yeah. Right, okay. Let's get this show on the road. Me and Sonia are still wearing the same clothes. We are. Because I bought a whole load of stuff yesterday. But it didn't look... Oh, you can go to the captain's... Uh, sorry, not the captain, the, the clothing chest on the ship. And... Um, yeah. You can, see, can get James, I'm just looking for that. Oh, there it is. Uh, should we get Spanky? Spanky! Spank the monkey. Right, we are right heading in what I think is the right direction. Oh, there he is. Uh, is someone on lookout duty? Because I don't want to hit things. I can't see. Snake Island is in front of us. We are roughly on course, yes. Uh, okay. There might be other stuff between us and there, though. Um, well, I'll just, I'll just drive. Own. You tell me left, right, right. guys. We're, we're gonna need, we're gonna need to be really on the ball with this with a big, big old ship like this. We're gonna need to trim the sails to get the, to get the wind. So the wind is currently blowing right to left. So if we can trim all three sails to the left, we might I don't think we're going to catch the sail because it's actually blowing behind us, isn't it? <coughs> but the wind might rotate for us to. <coughs> Have you done the one up near you, James? Yep. Yeah. Just the main sail. Right. Uh, Yeah, I'm now doing it. I've already done the front one, whoever's now changing it. Okay. I'm now doing the middle one. There we go. Hopefully, the wind might change the direction slightly more we'll catch it. Uh, what are we look out front? We're clear out front. I want to run into a skeleton ghost ship. No, well, I don't. Skeleton not ship. Not after last night. Not a ghost, oh. not a ghost ship. A skeleton yeah, ship. Yeah, the ghost... Yeah, the ghost ships are something completely different and also something really fucking weird. They're, they're, I don't know which work, which is worse, the skeleton or the ghost ship. It was terrible last night. That just, that so thing no, just got all the, not go down. Right, we're all the cannons ship. are full anyway. Uh, can you take us left a few degrees? Um, oh shit. Uh, shipwreck Bay is shooting at us. Left hey? bit, oh, yeah. Uh, yeah. Yeah, there is skeletons on the island shooting at us. Right, straighten her up, uh, uh, James. We're all good. Heading into some nice clear. See? 
change for a minute. Come here. Okay, so course wise we should still be okay. The really annoying thing was we finished the we did the shroud breaker, me and James really quickly speed run uh, ran it. And we finished on Plunder Eight Post. Dave, I can just see you falling off there. <laughs> I can see it now. <laughs> he walks off the plank and never was to be seen again. Aiken Mo made it back. <laughs> he sat down. He's got, he's got the arm. <laughs> We're heading towards a storm, aren't we? It does look that way. Uh, if, if we do hit a storm... Yeah, oh yes, yeah, I just saw lightning. Yeah, if we do hit the storm, basically we're going to be, uh, we could actually get hit by lightning. Um, oh, joy. Which will cause, which will cause holes in the ship, uh, obviously, so we're going to need to lift them up and bail out. The other thing that might happen is, well, it will happen, is James will lose navigation. The, all of our compasses will, will go, uh, and we're just going to have to try and do our best manually. Um, so, Dave, can you can you keep an eye out front? I'm going to go and have a look on the map. And the I've lost compass. Okay. Yep, okay. And that's back. Try and, yep. try and maintain... Yeah, we'll go again. We'll go again. We'll go straight into the middle of it. So, I'm on the map. You can just keep this course. No, it's going to pull that right up. We could think we might run a bit close to Snake Island. Uh, yeah, full three degrees to the left. Uh, Sonia, can you get... Uh, we'll, we'll, we'll just take the light from there. Um, I'm, I'm down here. I am. Might be on the lower Oh yeah, I've got it. We might need to go a few degrees to the left. Can you I'm see? hard over. Yeah, there's a light. Yeah, there, yeah, there it is. Uh, Crunch. I should have said that earlier, shouldn't I? Yep, yeah, okay, if you can pull it back to the right again now, uh, Dave. Should be clear of Snake Island, I think. Are we clear, Dave? Not quite, not quite. Yes, it looks like we're clear. Oh, oh shit, I just took another light oh. on bolt. I've got it. Where was I can that? see it. Down here. Yeah, uh, yeah, that's it, that's it, that's fine. Oh, there's another one. Where's yeah, I'm one? not going to go and bail out. Yeah, and the really tricky thing with this is, bail out two decks to, uh... No, I know, I've already found that out. <laughs> right, I'll bail, you, you, uh, you do the work. I've got them all. I think we're coming out of it, so... Yep, yeah, I've got compass back, I've got positive control of that. Yeah, we're, we're clear, and there's Plunder 8 post out in front of us. Uh, if you can trim a few degrees to the right, uh, there's, no, there's a ship there. There's a, there's, there is a ship there. Typical. Uh, yeah, that'll do you, James. Do you. God, I hope they want to be friendly. Did I put the I don't alliance back? I did go up there, I can't remember what I put the flag up. Let me go and have a look. <clears throat> Some of this atmospheric music sometimes reminds me of like, the, the, the atmospheric stuff in Fallout 4. Mm. Oh, oh, I did put it out. It's fine. All the cannons are full anyway. Yeah. I filled them. Julio. Julio's not putting up with any crap tonight, is she? Yeah. I, if, we come we, in peace. When we, when we, we come get, in peace, shoot when, to kill. When, when, <laughs> when we get close, uh, if we just sort of be friendly, like a boy, uh, 
Uh, let's, it's only a, it's, it's a sloop. I'm sure that it's a sloop. They're not going to pick one of us. It's going to be one or two people at most. Right. Uh, a few degrees to the right. Games. Just you. Uh, Dave, can you give me a shake when it's good to drop the end? Yep, sure can. Right. Probably a good time okay. to drop it. Okay. Yeah, yeah, I've got the hole. I've got the hole. I've got the hole. Okay. I can't find my way around this ship. So used to the other one. Yes. The extra deck. You throw the, the sloop. It's so easy. Uh, it's Don't designed for one person. I'm a nice person. Completely. Yeah. Uh... You're a deck. Okay. <laughs> right. I'm on the island. If we head. We head to. Oh, here we go. Here's our... There we go. We're friendly. We're not. We're not here to. Uh... We're not here to play up. Hi. Let's form an alliance. Well, I've, I've, yeah. uh, I've given him the, I've, I've put the alliance flag up. Is anyone still on the ship? No, I'll go on it no. now. Well, you've given right, him the I'm, universal I'm greeting. Ah, we, bra, we, um, um, mini bong, or whatever. Ah, we, gra, ah, I can't remember. Ah, we, gra, we, mini bong. What? What's it? I think now you, now you put a G in the middle. I've forgotten it. Bar wheat, ground, our wheat, mini bomb. Yeah, there you go. Yeah. The unstoppable skin flints. That's us. We are the unstoppable skin flints. Right. Okay, so seeing as it's being nice and friendly, we hope. Um, let's head on through. We need to go to the pub. All of us, or just to. Yeah, we all. If you want to. Uh, oh, sorry, not the pub. It's not the pub. It's Madame Olivia, isn't it? Yeah, I'll just I'll wait here. I'll just keep an eye. No, oh, come over. It's fine. Okay. But the worst that's going to happen is he's going to sink this ship and we'll, we'll mermaid to another one because we'll just, we'll just head to somewhere else. It's fine. Um, I'm coming. I'm so cynical. So, <laughs> we Le got Gamier a load of loot yesterday for our, yeah, so for our alliance. When we're in, yeah, when we were in the Alliance, they went and sold loads of stuff. Oh yeah, there we go, there's the other crew. Yeah. You're part of a Ripper Alliance! Oh, it's very spooky. I've got a feeling they're French, and my herd gurdy is automatically started playing French games. The Gamer, yeah. Is it, is it just me or is it just playing French, the French national anthem amongst those things? I don't know. But anyway, can we crack on? I'm not sure what right, yeah, crack on. I've not long lived on this planet. Are we, yep. are we all in the tent? Right, okay. Europe. Yes. Right, so the tall tail is next to her here, the, uh, the cursed road. So we need at least three votes. And then she will tell us. There we go. Oh, did I just do? Yeah. Yep, you voted. Here's... Here we go. She's now going to give us what for. Pray enter and take respite. I am Madame Olivia of the Order of Souls, <coughs> and your arrival was foretold to me. As was your quest to seek out and destroy the abomination once known as Briggsy. As you may know, the Order offers bounties for the skulls of those undead wretches that roam the Sea of Thieves. Yet even I am not permitted to send pirates in pursuit of a skeleton lord. 
For that would be sending them to oblivion. In life, Briggsy was a flamboyant adventurer who thrived on danger and excitement. How could she not seek out the fabled shores of gold? But now, she has been consumed by evil's thrall and is a fearsome foe to all she encounters. And yet, if the whispers on the wind are true, you have already claimed the Shroud Breaker. Perhaps we have. there is a chance you might prevail. Very well. These papers hold fragments of memories from those who pledge allegiance to the Skeleton Lord. If you can decipher their meanings, they may lead you to artifacts, relics of Briggsy's life. Bring all that you find to me, and I will shine a light into the darkness that awaits you. <coughs> Go now. I must prepare the ritual ready for your return. You know, all of us are here. It's like when we're in one of those rides, uh, like alt towers, where you all have to just stand there like muppets, listening to the exposition before you're allowed on the ride. <laughs> right. Okay. Um, so we've got a new book with clues in it. Bounty hunter. This book will guide you towards a pair of ancient relics belonging to Briggsy. Feed those who protect the relics and bring them to me. I've got a feeling this is going to take a while, you know. Um, we need to we need to defy, defeat the enemies that are guarding whatever um, they've got. Bring them to Olivia, then she will tell us where Briggsy is. We then have to go and defeat Briggsy and bring stuff. Yeah, that the, the first stones back. Okay, Chronicle of Forgotten Lives is transcribed by Madame Olivia. Private property of the Order of Souls within these pages. Right now, best to transcribe the memory. Recollections himself may be confused. It's part of the information of Divine King II. The memories of Captain Marrow. That he had a boner. Uh, the Scout Alliance. Hellbound Dove. Our treasures are buried and we have her key. We sail away to find an island where it can hide safely. Where? Where do we hide it? Keep searching, keep looking. In the northern ancient isles, it's a good place to keep it. So we've got to look for a little Durdle Door looking thing. Yeah. A little what looking thing? One thing with a hole in it. I think one is one will take us to a key, one will take us to a chest. If I remember right. It's been a while since I've done this. Um Trying to recognise that. I think I know what that island is. It's the one with the arch on it. Um, the, uh, the cove in the top. It's got a little archway on it. Is it? Uh, oh, it's up. It's right up in the top left. Of the map, I think. It said Northern Isles. Uh, northern oh, edge of the show. ancient isles. Northern edge of the ancient isles. So there, is a, there is a little the, island. The map is split in. Yeah. There's, an, there's an island with an arch in the top left and the side. So, oh, can I. Sorry, can I get on the map? Right. Um, the ancient isles. Um, see, that's got. The archway on it, but it's not in the ancient isles. That's the shores of plenty. The ancient isles is where we are now. Who's picking up quests? They're in the barrels that I've got. Oh, um. Uh. It's... Let me read that clue again. Northern Ancient Isles. So the Ancient Isles end around here and become the shores of plenty in the wild. So the last map, uh, the last island in the north 
before it becomes the the other regions is Castaway Isle. And if I remember rightly, there's an arch on it. There's a worth a stop. If if it's the island I'm thinking of. Let's go. Yeah, it's basically north from here. So let's get the. Uh, are we all on board? Yeah. Yep. Right, can I have a couple of guys on the um, anchor? Uh, and whoever's I'm on the games wheel. are you? Yep. Right, okay, so we need to swing north. Already there. Fair enough. Straight on then. Uh, let's get these. Oh, we're going into the wind. I thought we were already north. No, I'm on it, as in turning to turning to north. So. Oh. I already had the wheel hard over and we'd be going to north. That's what I was thinking. Oh, look what's right out in front of us. Look at that. Fucking great big rock arch, look. <laughs> look at the book. The, the, that look fucking great the big door. arch. There's a, there's a great big um, arch. So we're looking for an island near that arch. Mm-hmm. <laughs> Whoa! Hard right! Hard right! Quickly! Hard right? Whoa. Are you sure? Yep. Yeah. Yes. I was rocks. very sure. No, I was very sure because there was a fucking great big dynamite barrel in our path. <laughs> oh, okay. We had that yesterday. There was the, yeah, don't, don't... I know if I say hard right, there's a fucking good reason for it. <laughs> all those I didn't barrels. know we were doing a Dave as all. <laughs> Are we going Trust for a me, swim? I was not... Yeah, I've gone to pick up those load of... There's a load of glowy stuff. Leave, leave the barrel. I'm pretty sure I resent that comment, but I'm not <laughs> sure why. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, James, not, not to sound a dick, but if I shout hard right, there's a fucking good reason. <laughs> well, no, it's the only reason I questioned it, was, it uh, was because there was a bloody great rock in front of us as well, to our right, so I wanted to make sure you fine, didn't actually mean right. Yeah, because it was on our left-hand side, and it was I, it, I couldn't Anything tell whether we were just going to clip it. If we clipped it, then basically I, I was dead, uh, anyone near me was dead, and the ship was down, basically. I can't see anything else shiny. There's a bottle right, just beyond uh, that barrel that's shiny. Oh, yeah, yeah got don't, it. Don't, if it's a quest, just leave it. If it's a bottle... <laughs> oh, sorry. Too um, late. No, yes, the point, it's not, there's no point picking them up, because we're not going to be doing um, Oh, they, they, they don't do any harm, I'm just, there's no point picking them up, so, uh, yeah, we're not doing them. Um, right, we've gone hard left, so I'm, yeah. I'm hoping, I'm, ho I'm hoping that we should clear that rock in front of us. Are we all on board? Yep. Yep. I don't think we're going to clear that. We are very close. Yeah, we'll clear it. We right. go hard left or hard right. Can can we have right. the anchor, please? Anybody? But we like watching you struggle. <laughs> um. And I'll fucking grab the sail. Don't lift the fucking thing up. Yeah, we're fine. We're, we're miles away from it. We're fine. Miles away from it. Miles away. We could fit a couple of buses through there. I don't think the health and safety objective would agree with you with on that one. Health and safety in 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 the Sea of Thieves. Or, or what is this thing you are to speak? So either where our destination is here at this island with the with the rocks in the background, with the with the arch in the background. Or that, that map the northern arch is a place to keep it. Oh no, that's that's Snake Island is now coming up. I think it's beyond it. I think it's beyond uh, beyond Snake Island, which is now coming up on our right. 
Oh, let me up on the deck. Yeah, so it says see about a little isle. Right, this is three little islands, but I can't... Is there anything there? Oh. You camp on the little isle. I can't see anything. Uh... Oh, there, there's a tiny little island over there. Could be that. Yeah. So once we get around this arch, James, if you can pull left. Yep. So we go in between the. Mm -hmm. uh, there's a. No, actually, don't go. No, go right. Go right. Okay. Go right. It's too narrow. Uh, a few degrees to the right. Keep going. Keep going. Keep going. Yeah, straight now. Clear this. So, where is Castaway Isle? Is that little thing there? It's on our left once yeah. we clear all yeah. the Tiny little island there, look. Mm hmm. Yeah, I think that is. Hard to port! Hard to port! I've not got any port, I've got some sherry. Got some whiskey. <laughs> got any cheese? <laughs> I have actually. I could do with some Oh, I could just do with some cheese. Yeah, I could. Yeah. We've talked it up now. Oh, that right. could be well. Straighten up. Center up. Uh, right, get ready with the yeah, anchors, everyone. Well. Yeah, yeah, tell me when. Tell me, is anybody looking? I'm looking up. We're going up to it now. I would say. Drop it any time yeah, now. Know. Yeah. Down it goes. Oh, here we go. I stand with this stuff. I'm not sure, but it's come to where I am now. So, Dave. Uh, Dave, where are you going? I said to come to me. We need to. I think we're gonna. Tell us something. He's got a key. We've been heard, right? Let's go in. Yeah. There he is, Captain Avery. Let's just smash the shit out of him. Yeah, this is our dude. He's got a key. Yeah, we want the key, and we've got it. Yep, back to the ship. Back to the ship. Ah, huh. Big old shark as well, watch out. Sharks don't eat people though. Sharks don't eat people. Too. People do. <laughs> Is that the Charlton Heston shark? <laughs> oh shit! What <laughs> happened there? Right. The shark. I did. I I've did put the key. Shark. Yep. I've put the key. Um, in the captain's oh, cabin. Yeah, okay. Yeah, so I've put the key in the captain's cabin next to the, next to the skull. There's a there's a little shelf next to the captain's bed. Uh -huh. I've put it on there. Right, so the next thing we need to do is the memories of Blackheart Bill, the Skeleton Alliance, the Hellbound Dove. 
We sail with her special guest in the southern ancient isles. We look for an island to keep it, look for one to hide it. Past the big island we sailed, best to find a littler one, more likely to be missed. So we're heading for a really small island. There's a picture of it. Um, not sure whether I recognise that island. I can see a ship to our 11 o'clock in the distance. Trying to recognise that island. Recognise that, James? You've seen that island before. One. Find a place to bury the chest. I've sent along with others. Start with scary, skelly, cold teeth. The loot no. he likes to. No, is the short answer. Ship's going the other way. When we find it, find a place for a chest to rest, they rest for the well known, they make the bill bury it. Finally gets to rest his shovel, Mrs. Old Captain Barry. He and the others come again, come to torment the bill. They call out, Bill is weak, stupid, hit old Bill, Bill's skull, all he is and knows. Rolls down the sand, lost, maybe. Right. I think I might know where the island is. Like, oh, bill is again that one day. Is that one there? Island, just it's it's not far from here. I yeah, there's an island it's just still going to be north, just to the north. I think. I don't know. No, I, I I I think I know what island it is. Um, okay. it's it um. Um, let me have a look at the map. I know what island it is. It's, it's got a slope leading up the side of it. Um, yeah. Yes. Look out point. Look out point. Um, anybody, anybody looking at the map with me? Can you see there's um, a path no, on the right hand side of it? Anybody here? Sorry, I'm up the, yeah, I'm yeah, at the top yeah, of the hand. Yep, 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 yep. See this path on the right, or uh, uh, see, closest to you? This path that sort of goes up here. Yeah. If you look at the picture in the book, Sorry, wrong one. Um, well, let's just go there and see if it's in the, the book. One. There's a path leading up the side. Yeah. There's a path Try. leading up that side. I, th I think it's there. It's it's south. Basically, uh, yeah, with a little bias to the west. South, southwest. <coughs> okay. Let's um, raise anchor and head south then. South by south, southwest. Yeah, pull the wheel right over to the right. It is. Right, okay, and Dave. are we all aboard? All aboard? Let's see a bloody thing. Oh, storm that way. Right, we did it once, we'll do it again. We're a good that, solid um, crew. Island in front, that island in front of us is the, um, is the one for the arena. Um, we're going by various bits and pieces to fight in the arena. Okay. Right. Passing east now. Look at him. 
we'll go and double check our heading. Southwest. Sorry, southeast rather. Southeast, yep. There is a ship. I don't know if it's our friends, but there's a ship. Um, uh, if it's off Brooks Hollow, then it. I don't know. Friend. I don't know who it is, but they're kind of in front of us now. Yeah, I can see them. I think they are the the ones we saw earlier. Okay. South west, we need to go, James. Yeah, I know. Uh, but well, there's a south south west. Yeah, I don't want to go too hard over just yet because of the uh, impending islands. I'm going to weave between this island in front of me and the the rock. You're going to weave between them. Weave. Weave. <laughs> oh. We can drop the anchor and let you run at the little boys room. That's fun. <laughs> you mean the big boys room? Thank you. That's the no, oldest I, person I, here. I, you I, know, I know. <laughs> How old are you? Respect your elders. I'm 43. About 52 now. Oh, I'm just older than you. I feel. I, well, yeah, but when's your birthday? January. February. I'll be 43 what, in January. Yeah, well, I yes, was 43 in February, so I'm 11 months older than you, so listen to me, woman. <laughs> 13 months older than me, you mean. During the war? <laughs> yes. They all can. I've, I've been drinking, shut up. <laughs> you know, can. <laughs> During the war! <laughs> Is someone going to trim the front sail for me? Please. Where is the wind it's going left the other to right, isn't it? Yeah, right to left. Uh, oh yeah, so sorry, you want right to turn left. it that way? That's it. You want to hit it? Basically it needs to be... Where the other two are. Keep going, there we go. Lovely, jubbly. There we go, right. and she's full. Oh, good. Oh. I think so. So after this rocket that's in front of us, if I veer to the right, to our more westerly course. Fancy crisps. I've got wine <laughs> gums. I had wine I've been gums, attempting I just popped the bag and now, they're, now, they're, now, they're, now the carpet's eating them. Oh, lovely. I've been attempting to make crisps. How could you miss your mouth, Andy? Not manic. Sorry. <laughs> How could I miss a target that big? Yeah. <laughs> Who's big as your asshole? That's the conversation we had before you guys joined, by the way. Wow. Well, no, no, he said, come to my... Well, to go to this orifice. please don't like, mind us. Carry on. And I said, is that a euphemism? And he said, no. And he went, oh, no, I got the wrong hole. This one's my asshole. It's three times... It's much bigger. And I was like... Okay, <laughs> so I'm just, um, I'm not being a bitch, it's just what he said. Right, we're heading southwest now. Fair So I'm figuring we'll probably have to turn a little bit more south, or is that the island a bit more to our west there we have to go to? Um, one second. My, my, my compass is blurry, it won't load. Oh, there we go. Get cream for that. Uh, I think the heading's fine at the minute. Okay. Cool. I don't. Um, we've got to clear under eight post. Which I presume once is the right Once we clear un under eight post, yeah. Once we clear under eight post, we can just pull a safe. Heading south now. That little island in the distance there on the horizon. Could be. Go south now. South now. Uh, actually, yeah, you're not going southeast. That is our destination. Pull back round to the slightly south southwest. That's the island we're going for. 
This one, the close one here. Ah! What? This close one right to our, right here. Yeah, this is the one. Okay. Sonia's gone bye bye. <laughs> bye, Sonia. Yeah. Nice knowing you. I've got the mermaid. It's yeah, okay. Yeah, go straight. Go straight. Go straight. Rumor is it you had travelled by mermaid. <laughs> <laughs> Hello, I'm back. <laughs> I've actually got my mermaid t-shirt on today. She's in it herself. Oh dear. Is this Down. our little island? I think so. Look out point. Okay. Up round to the right. Yep. I'm gonna get the sails up before we go north of the Jimmy? I'm going to circle the island apparently. <laughs> oh, okay. Mm. I missed that bit. <laughs> I was going to say, um, like, <laughs> yeah, yeah, let's just get, let's just get right close to one of the beachy sides. Yeah. You can, you can see now, can't you, James? Because I've got the sails up. Yeah, yeah, I can see, yeah. I don't know if there's a beach on this side, but, uh... Yeah, once we get round there will be. By the looks of it, it's a bit stony. My little friends are in the distance. There we go. Molly's. This is where we need to be. Anyway. Uh, straight, yes? Yep. Wait a minute, wait a minute. Chest. Oh. Need to Let's go. Chest. Where are they? Gonna get you little piggy. Hmm. There. I know, I saw that. So where they were guarding here, have they left something here or...? Yes! We're going to have to dig.
key required to pick this up uh, to unlock it. So we've got the key aboard the ship. <laughs> Lots of piggies over here. Favorite food. One of your five a day. Two cups. Okay. I've got a storage crate coming slowly. Gonna come into the captain's cabin. I'm I'll coming. open the chest with the key. What is that noise? Are you coming in the captain's cabin. James is. James Ow. is fapping. It's past the watershed, I can do whatever noise I like. Dave? Yeah? Captain's cabin, back upstairs. Okay, I was just dropping stuff into barrels. We're not patient enough for that. <laughs> Are we all here? Yes. Mm -hmm. Actually, we've got an ear. So she wants these things. Briggsy's broken spyglass. Briggsy's star map. That will tell us where Briggsy is. We then go and defeat her and we get one of the stones for the shroud break, I think. So yeah, plunder eight post. So it's like going on on a quest for the infinity stones, but we don't even need to go do any time travel for it. Ooh. Plunder eight post is where our buddies are. Going northeast. <clears throat> right. James, are you on the wheel? No? James? I think James. someone's disappeared. No, he's just stood in the captain cabin, uh, captain's cabin, not doing anything. That's right. Um, let's get the anchor up and I'll grab the wheel and that's on course. Oh! You can see the outpost is just over there. I had to go to the little pirate's room. Drain your peg ah. in. Drain your grub barrel. <laughs> Our friends over there? Yep. There was a yeah. euphemism there, folks. Did you spot it? <laughs> Is there anyone out there to spot anything? I have one viewer. I'll have you there. Is it you? Hello, James's mum. <laughs> <laughs> Hi, Chloe. I can prove a point. <laughs> I can prove a point by just saying yeah. that it's disgusting to either my daughter or my mother, just to prove it's not them. That's Go watching. to sleep, Chloe. Or we'll <laughs> take away the Wi-Fi. Chloe's in bed. She's asleep. She's a good girl. Andy gets a message on the stream going, "That's what you think." Moi. <laughs> Moi. <laughs> 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 I don't know how she's watching it. Her phone's <laughs> down here next to me, so I don't see how she's watching it. What's with her secret phone? Some kind of clairvoyance going on there that I don't know about. What is with the phone that you don't know about? Broke? Hmm? My iPad Pro's <laughs> in the office. Is it? It is. Are you sure? Yes. I saw it as I went to get Herman, the moist water machine. When you went to get your Did moist, get your moist reptile wet. in. My moist reptile, yep. Who's currently asleep. Oh no, she's awake. She's right next to me. 
She's watching. That's my viewer. Okay. Um, the tortoise. Oh, um, can somebody get ready on the anchor, please? Mm -hmm. Oh, yeah. Oh, Sonny's on it. Okay. I had about 10 viewers last night. I've got one tonight. Runs around boats. Fish Loco said he joined us again tonight. It's he did, him, yeah. Is it? No. I would say hard left now. And I would yeah. say anchor now. Now. Slam on the anchors. Look at that. Oh, that was perfect. Beautifully I executed. I knew I had semen. Fucking hell, we're Mars out. <laughs> Only a stupid land level would say yeah. something like that. You know, you know you said thinking I was... you did really well. <laughs> <laughs> You're not in a safe space now, James. Never am with that. Fucking hell, we're nearly on the next lap. We're nearly on the next lap. Fuck me. Oh, shit. <laughs> Such a fucking white privileged CIS male hold. I can see a little bit. Can somebody get the landing CIS. there? Can CIS. somebody please get the landing there? Can, can somebody get a landing there? I've just I've just caught a fucking whopper. I can see your lips moving, but all I can hear is wah. <laughs> yeah. From you. <laughs> I wanna know what a CIS right. is. Do you know what? I want to know what that means too. I've seen it so many times. And I know it means like white privilege, but I don't understand what the CIS actually means. I'm going to look it up right now. Guys, are we, uh, are we at Olivia's tent? Yes. Me and, me and Sonia are. I am. Find where you are. There you are. Even the monkey so. got here before you, Dave. Give her the star map. Give her the spyglass. Are we ready? Yes. James, are you, oh, you're here. Right, here we go. We're not going to get told where to go next. Are those Briggs these precious treasures? Let me see. Ah, the tools of an adventurer. I spend so much of my time surrounded by bones. It is sometimes easy to forget that they were once people, too. Tell no one what you are about to witness. There are some secrets that even we, the Order of Souls, are forbidden to share. I'm going to share it with you. By recall's light and wisdom's might, the past shall point towards the future. Behold the true power of the Order of Souls. There are few left okay. with the knowledge to create an artifact with such potential. Rock always helps. Mm. She should break it. Yeah, she broke a bone. I've got my controller on my chair. The, orders the entire thing this is shaking. The compass will point the way to Briggs. No matter where upon the sea of thieves she may be lurking. Once again, <clears throat> I implore you to be cautious. Death has only made we now have formidable. A compass. See the uh, compass I've been given? Yep. Yeah. Yeah. It will point directly at where she is. She's currently that way, which is northeast. Where did that just go? So, I was in the quests. So cisgender basically means um, a term for people whose gender identity matches their sex assigned at birth. So I am a cis male because I identify as oh. male. Oh! And I have oh, a... Oh, sorry, where are you going with going that for a second? Yeah. <laughs> That's what it means. We've got a... Follow this compass now. Is she on the island? Yep. No. 
she's not on this island. She lies to the northeast of where we are now. We do have wide arc. Oh, we can do that. I'm on the view. Oh god, I love you. We need to we need to keep to the left, otherwise we're just gonna ram our dudes. We're hard over. Right, I'm gonna pop to the little the girls room. Actually that's an opportune moment. If um Sean is gonna do that, I'm gonna do the same. The I'm going little to the pirate went through. Well, I will just sit here like a Billy No Mates then. Like a cisgender Billy No Mates. You still with me, Dave? I'm sitting on the flank. How, how was your day, my friend? Um, it's a, they're a little bit long at the moment. I've been doing some some practice tests today that I have to submit tomorrow. Mm -hmm. um, which is the, the first first time I'm doing tests for equity and for land law, so mm -hmm. it's kind of just getting all of my shit together. Really. Okay. Just understand, trying to understand how it all works and uh, put it into context and whatnot. So it's been a bit of a long day. How about you? I haven't done much today, to be fair. I've been playing Metal, Sig, Metal Gear Solid today. But um, mm -hmm. the last couple of days I've uh, transferred all my old music from Minidisc, back from the Jacks days, oh, wow. onto my computer. And I've whittled out all the crappy tracks that I don't want to, never going to play again. And mm -hmm. done, the, done the good ones. And I have ten and a half hours of music, and I had to record it all back in, in real time. Because obviously they're on mini disc, so I couldn't just like transfer the MP3 across. It was all real time. Um, so it took me three days, <laughs> ten and a half hours of music, and stuff. the rest of my stuff's like uh, on MP3, so it's not too bad. Um, but yeah, it's it's been quite an adventure. And then I found a disc up which I made for my very first Jacks in Hell Hempstead back in wow. 1998. <laughs> that might have been 97 actually. That's some old um, school MIDI right there. So old, and it was proper, it was all MIDI file. Every single track was a MIDI file recorded in. It was awful. <laughs> so bad. <laughs> oh my god. But, um, yeah, it's, it's been a fun, fun couple of days listening to all the old stuff and thinking, well, oh, I could bring that back, or oh, I could do... I found a couple of blinders that I've recorded and, and um, mm. obtained that I've never even done. I've, I've got an awesome version of One Vision by Queen. And an awesome version of Runaway by Bon Jovi. Um, so I think I might. Um, oh, I'm back. Just as you mentioned, Queen. How ironic. Oh, the Queen's back. Um, yeah. Don't you think? <laughs> so yeah. The wench is back. Yeah, I really too. do think. I really do think. Right. Raise anchor and crack on. Oh, sorry. Dave, get off the plank. Okay. Look at him, just sitting there. Dave's not even in the room at the moment, so he can't he's help us. I am. Sit sat on the plank. I'm just making myself some toast. You guys can go and evacuate stuff. I want to put some stuff in. He told me all my <laughs> <laughs> That took a second to click what was going on there. I thought, what? <laughs> oh, yeah, I get you. <laughs> you could, right, oh, okay, yes. Yeah, so if we hang a right, if we hang a right... Um, I'll just go, okay. if we go south, I'll just go wide up left. No, northeast. Northeast. Oh, I apologise. Sorry, I thought you said. Um, yeah, I was I was saying go left to avoid our uh, buddies. Yeah, no, but they're, they're miles away now. Right. Okay. I've got the. I've got the. Um, well, we've all. We should all have the, the compass. I think. So if you go to your quests, and then hold it up, it, they're direct. The where we're going is directly behind us at the moment. We just need to come round. Yep. Come round. Turn about. If I right stand eye. here, can you, that's not going to make it, I think that's going to be upside down to you, don't it, James? Can't yeah, anyway, the wheels are basically. Right. Doesn't matter, just tell yeah, me. Okay, just, just keep turning in until, until I say stop. Keep turning in. Oh, what? Lost Dave. He's in the kitchen. No, I'm not. I'm sat on the plank. He's... He's in the kitchen whilst he's um, on the planking. 
Yeah. Right, straighten her up He's now. Astro projecting. Keep, keep going. Keep going. Keep going. <laughs> keep going to the right. I think I know where she is. You believe be. in astro projections, ESP, telekinesis, <laughs> the Loch Ness Monster, keep and the theory right of now. Atlantis. Straighten her up. There is an island right in front of us. There is an we island right in front of us. I think... There's a steady paycheck in it. I believe are anything we, are you we... say. Um, we are paying attention, honest. It's the island is okay. in front of us. Is it the tall island or is it yeah, the there, flat island? There is, there is two islands in front of us. One of these, I think, is where Briggsy is. I think, mm. judging by the fact that if I hold the compass up, it's slightly, very slightly to the right. I think it's that island, um, the front right. There's, you can just see the trees. We don't feel like we're moving very fast. We're not. Yeah, but we could trim not. the sails and make it move ourselves. We could trim the sails to, to go a bit faster, yeah. The wind is almost basically directly behind us, so if we trim the sails roughly sent right of centre by the looks of it, we might get about forty five degrees. There we go. Risk our sails done. Bit more, bit more, bit more. <gasps> there we go. Let me check that compass again. Oh, now it's gone slightly left. Oh no! Uh oh, music! Megalodon. What's coming? Megalodon. Dave, we've got a Megalodon! Oh no! no. Are we going to clear that island? It's behind oh. us. Yeah, yeah, we're fine. It's on our right. <coughs> Can you, can you keep it straight, James? Because you're throwing the... Uh, I'm, I'm, I'm going to go down. Yeah, I'm just... I'm straight. Right, it's not it's this island. It's behind us, the, It's the... Ooh, I can... Oh, hang on. There's a jewel on there. Do we want to go and get the... There's a jewel there. Do Stop. we want to go yeah, and get it? Do, 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 do. Oh, not the anchor. Where's the anchor? I can't find it. Oh, well, there's a Captain the Tan Man Bahan on this island as well. Has he got flames coming out of his head? I've got a perp. Uh, oh my god, he's right on me. I've got the jewel. Probably, make the Probably. Has, he got, has he got flames coming out of his head? Well, if you look, see him. I, I can't really look on I him. I can't see him. He's right in front of you. I can't see him either now. I... No, I can't. <laughs> I don't think he had flames. Oh, there he hard. is. Uh, it's just a regular captain. Uh, yeah. We could... Yeah. Kill him and take your skull. We didn't sell the skull we had, did we? We did, I sold it. Oh, you did? Right, okay. Mm -hmm. If you guys want to go and do that, you can... You know, I guess I'll take this jewel up. No, let's just... Uh, let's just carry on with it. We're just getting on. Um, yeah, wherever we're going is right out in front of us. Okay, jewel is down. <clears throat> what? Back on the way. Whatever wheel. that island is in front of us, I think that is our destination. I think Briggsby is there. Uh, okay. And the island out in front of us is. Crook's Hollow. It's where we were today, James, to do the, to do the trade breaker. Is it? Mm -hmm. And where we were last night, in fact, uh, Dave was on here to do the trade, to collect mm -hmm. the trade breaker in the first place. Right, let's get this anchor up. Right, Dave, you just sit happily on the uh, plank again. <laughs> you just eat your toast, my man. Let's see. I'm eating mine whilst raising the anchor. I mean, women can do yourself. more than one thing at a time. I, I don't train right, Okay, I'm not being funny, but I can actually <laughs> do more than one thing at, at one time as well. So, just, it's not all just, it's not limited to the female gender. I'll just well, of course, you can breathe at the same time as doing no, something. No, I can do multiple things and on blink. stage. I can do sound, light, keyboards and sing all at the same time. Not very well. Really? I can, I can do it. 
<laughs> James, James, and, and like James, dance can shoot. James can shag his wife and text his girlfriend all at the same time. I barrels, have... barrels, barrels. I have. No right, I'll get. I'll keep my own. Don't worry. Well, it's hard to see from where I am, Andy. Really. <laughs> I'm only speaking to you. Okay. Well, um, don't speak to Toasty. The heat will do much. If uh, <laughs> <laughs> so I, I, w I was just, I was just about to say, if Lindsay's watching, I'm sorry, but she's not watching. If, she's if Lindsay safety. was your one watcher, but she is my girlfriend, but, uh, and I don't have a wife, so and I wouldn't be anyway. I'm not that kind of guy. There's a skull. Yeah, don't be, worry about no, that. No, you'd be emailing. I want the skull. Yeah, grab the skull. There's a load of barrels. But I mean, if there's any decent sort of um, bits and pieces in the barrels, maybe bring it back. But I don't think we're going to need it. We're just going to get to this island, defeat Briggsy, take the stuff. I think we take the stuff back to Madame Olivia. Wood, food, cannibals. Um, uh, oh, oh, fish locos coming on. He's just like my queen. Whoa. Yeah, I didn't. Bit, just been taken out by him. Not taken out, but completely. Are you dead? No, uh. no, no. I'm munching a banana. I've not eaten a banana <laughs> underwater whilst being chased by a shark. It's almost as good as eating toast whilst trying to play the game. Nothing's as good as eating toast while trying to play the game. You're not even playing. You're just sitting there on a plank. Oh, there's something out there. I'm in the game. Blowing. There's something else blowing. Oh, That's great, you, but there's a shark out there. You can be my guest, because I'm out there with a shark I'm far too pretty to die. <laughs> well, seeing as uh, I'm I've a got a pair of testicles here, I'll go and uh, get them then. Well, that's true, because I call don't. Them, you call them testicles, I call them shark bait. And the shark's <laughs> right behind you. It's just his quest. <laughs> Actually, quest. There's um, two sharks. Yeah, I'm going to leave it. Yeah, I would. Too. Oh. <laughs> there you go. I'm dead. Gone. <laughs> right. <coughs> right. You can wait. <laughs> right. You lot can weigh the anchor while I'm waiting to respawn them. Off you okay. go. I'd just like to point out that I'm on the plank and I'm still alive. <laughs> I'm on the boat and still alive, thank I'm, you, and I went out there. I'm on the ship and still alive. Right, okay, so if we raise anchor. Dave, if you go to the front of the ship and just keep an eye on how close we are to that island, we are pretty close, aren't we? Not really. Are we not? Are we going to the no. right or left of the island? You know, at the minute we're all on the wank. <laughs> Look, <laughs> it, we've all had a drink. <laughs> Calm it down. <laughs> oh dear. So does that mean you're going to be at the gig on then, the first? <laughs> oh, Dave, oh, watch out, Dave's on the boat. Oh, Dave's on the bloody driving wheel. Oh, I didn't know you were here. I thought you were dead. No, no, I was... Okay, uh, right, oh, left, 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 Links. Right, let's, let's raise some sails and make it easy. Just, can you see where you're going, Dave, at all? Yeah. I'll raise the sails. Just do a slow circuit of the arm and come on the other side. Yeah. Okay. Uh, let me check that compass because now I'm going to find out that this isn't where we're supposed to be going. Uh, uh. Oh no, no, the compass is going nuts. Uh, hang on. No, the compass is still staying out front. Keep okay. going then. Still <laughs> staying northeast. So we keep northeast. going then. Okay, northeast, Dave. Northeast. <sighs> We're heading in the right direction, yes. If we trim the sails to the left, no, to the right, I right, I right. The right. It will do absolutely nothing, I think. I'm not going to catch it. Grab the f. They catch a bit. We're, he we're heading right towards the ghosty ships. Yeah, the right way We're not, now we're not, we're going wide of that. Um, where's the. We can all, I think we can all check the compass, not me. Yeah, I've been in the compass a couple of times. No, the, the, the stone one with the quest, yeah? 
Yeah. Mm -hmm. it's, uh, I'm look, I've got it in my hand yeah, as we speak. North okay. by northeast. Yep. North by northeast. Yeah, we want a few degrees to start, a few to degrees the to the right. Yeah. Let's see those two the right ah, the crab, the crab claw things here. That's what we need to head for. Good evening, Fish Loco. Fish Loco's here, guys. My, whoop reg whoop. my regular viewer. Whoop whoop. <laughs> Hello. Please follow me. Uh, so, so, Mr. Loco, uh, Dave's on the wheel. We're all <laughs> currently really, We're all really die. scared. We're all going to die. It's all right, there you go. We'll put it on autopilot. <laughs> yeah, but your idea of an autopilot is a great big blow-up doll that suddenly springs up at the wheel. <laughs> this is not airplane, this is battleships. It's the right <clears throat> movie, isn't it? I'm the autopilot. <laughs> <laughs> Fish Loco says, Dave's always on the wheel, when will you guys learn? <laughs> <laughs> Do you know what? <laughs> oh, he's you. not. He's left the wheel. <laughs> I'm now. Bollocks! Bollocks to a lot of you. I'm gonna set my tank, eat my toast, and sulk. He's eating his toast. Turn round. Yeah, we want a few round. degrees to. We need a few degrees. What? Bye. Hey. He's committed suicide. <laughs> <laughs> worth it, Dave. I love you, man. Come back. <laughs> Oh no no no! We can we can emote we can emote for this. There's an emote for this. There we go. Oh, the cheer emote is not waving. <laughs> cheer emote is not appropriate. No, I'm, just, I'm waving at him. I'm waving at him. Yeah. Oh, snip. Do you want to see where we're going? Oh, we're still heading in the right direction. Hold this. Uh, right, we have another island out in front of us. Could it be this one? If we keep here, I mean, if it if it is this island and it suddenly swings to the the compass suddenly swings to the left, just to keep you in the loop, uh, Fish Loco. Basically, uh, we've done several parts of tonight's quest to get this compass. This compass is now leading us to it is this island. It's this island. It's now drifting to the left, uh, where we have to where we have to. Um, Kill a skeleton lord called Briggsy um, and I'm take at the whatever she gives up. Uh, we need to go left, please, James. Kraken's fall. A foreboding. Can we go left after these rocks? It's, it is this island. It is this island. There's not very sharp. Yeah, that's fine. If we can get, can we get the sails. The, all the sails up, please. Uh, we'll keep the rear one up where James is. Yeah, it's like Jack Sparrow's compass. Yeah, yeah. Did that lead the way to Black Sparrow? I can't remember. It, it led to whatever your heart desires most. Oh yeah, that's it. Yeah. Oh yeah, we have the, we have our friend James with us tonight. Um, There's another boat. Yep. This looks inviting. <laughs> Switch with the sleep. Right. Bit. <laughs> yeah, it's to sleep. Uh, we just need to get in here. Um, if we can land here somewhere. Basically, we are taking on Briggsy here. Um, I'm on the anchor when you're ready. Take us right up to that. Beach there, James. Can you see the one on the left? Yep. Take us in there and then straighten us up when we get close to it. We can just hop ashore there. <clears throat> so, uh, Oh, Sonny's on the front end there. Uh, right, okay. Right. Go hard right now and drop the anchor, please, Sonia. Oh, yep. Yeah. We'll pull our front end out a little bit. Oh, maybe not. Oh, well. Right, uh, compass. I, I think this is where we need to be. 
Yeah, point in here. Let's yep. go ashore and have a look. Instantly music. This is skeleton chests. Skeleton keys. Yeah, we don't need that. We, we don't need these. Okay. Same what we're here There's for. Someone's watching us up the up the top. A wave. Can you see that green glow up? I don't know. It's just gone out. Mm. Yeah, I can see it. Yeah. Skeletons coming up, I can hear them. Whoa. Fire heat's gonna be more than She's here somewhere. Skeleton, she she's over here. Well, she's she's following. Well, the skeletons are following James. <laughs> yeah, James can be the bait. Thanks. Here's the collar. Oh no! I think I think she is. Yeah, she's in the water. Oh no! no. Someone's got, there, there's a bag. Yeah, she's. Someone's coming on. Someone's coming on our thing. What? Someone just coming on our ship. Did he attack you? Yes. Oh, he was coming on our ship. What, Captain Briggsy? Yeah, yeah up. no, and look, he's, he came on board with a skull. He's given us a skull and you just killed him. Well, I, just, I thought it was a skeleton at first. I didn't see who he was. No, the skeletons don't come aboard. She's dead. I got her. Oh no, she's not. No, she's not. No, she's not dead. She just disappeared. She's still alive. Back she's over on the 
by the tree. I'm going to the hold the the hold. Come down and go forward. Oh. Okay. Well. She disappeared again, she disappeared again. She Actually, didn't we have a couple of skulls? Did yes, one There she is. There's nothing worse. I don't think now? Right next to you. Behind you. Behind you. Is that someone what is that behind you? Is that or is there's a couple of good guys. There's a couple of the other crew here right next to me. Yeah, that's the crew that killed the vinegar. I killed one of them. You can't defeat me. Whoa. Yeah, this one, Paul 299. Surrender and I'll grant you a quick death. Where is she? Oh, she's over there. I see her. I'm trying to find some ammo crates. There's ammo in the hold of the ship. We won't have ammo, but I'm um, a limited supply on the ship. Over here. I'm out of ammo now. The ship. Whoa! Oh, I found the ammo crate. I got it. It's on the first floor, Dave. Next to. Can you bring it out with you? No, it's it's stuck in place. You know, she come down the steps, go forward, and it's on the right of the ship, front right on the first first deck below the main deck. You still going or? Yep. Okay, come back. Oh. We're gonna, we're gonna need to get all four of them on her. Oh, I've got to just hit her. She's in a maximum run away from the ship. We're gonna have to get in there with a, a, a sword and a gun. Mowed up again. Come on. There we go. I'm, I'm back. <coughs> uh, left side, wasn't it? No, you're not.
Gotcha. Oh, have we got any of the grenade, uh, any of the cannonballs on board? Uh, flame and blunder bombs. Uh, uh, potentially. Other? Yes, I believe so. Uh, Sorry, what type? Blunder bombs. Blunder bombs and the flame bombs. We can use them to throw at. A, you can use them like grenades. Oh, okay. I've got normal cannons. There we go, Today I've got three blunt bombs, five fire bombs. Let's fucking give us some of this shit. And I mean, you can five. grab them in your hand and throw them. Oh, can't find me. There she is. Oh! If anyone can get to me, I'm about to die. I am um, collapsed. Literally I'm can't on the way to the ferryman. Oh, I'm going to the ferryman then. I'm going to have to grab them blunder bombs, come ashore, and throw them right at her. I just. Got her with two flame bombs and a blunder bomb. Mm. He will go down eventually. It's just like a tough dust. I mean, imagine the two in this is crew too. <laughs> That's how I done this last time. Come on, Now stand still and die. Did you think I was alone? Oh no, wrong end. Blunder bombs. Got loads of blunder bombs, guys. I'm getting extras every time I hit him at the minute. Yeah, I am. Getting tired. Uh, no, I'm not. Where is he? Ah, he's right next to you. Yeah. Yep. I'm out of ammo. No, no, no. Bad for a fresh piece of beef. Now stand still and die. I'm too far for you. I'm too strong for you. Ah, anybody ashore? Can you revive me? No, coming ashore to get you. I'll try. Not quick enough. Oh. Oh, they got me too. No, I'm oh. gone. Run away. Okay. Grab the thunder bomb. Over come ashore here. and throw them out. I've got one. I'm coming. Surrender and I'll oh, grant you a quick death. I've got her. I think that was the last of the blunders. Really? There's three barrels and they all had blunder bombs in. Oh, I okay. I think there was more in. Um, I, t I emptied the top barrel, I took some out of the bottom empty. left barrel. That even one's even empty. The, it, when, when the blunder bombs are gone, go for the high bomb. How do you get them from your inventory? I don't understand how you. Press L oh, I've got it now, I found it. I found it. How much was the blunder bomb? The... They're the ones the one with, with the, like the like little pellets in it. In. Little pellets in it. Yeah, I can. Today you... We've got 11 firebombs in the bottom left barrel. Oh, that sounds like that, that hurt. It did. Oh, I died. It's my last bullet in my gun. 
on, bitch. Where are my bullets? <sighs> oh, we got his normal cannons left in the thing. If you're ashore, if you're on the ship, you can get her now because I've led her like a little way up the island. We've got, we've got, um, no, we've got cannonballs. Yeah, that's fine. Shoot them. Shoot that ammo. Okay. Shoot them. Shoot. I'm going you back see where I am. Oh. Can anybody the fox me? Been... No, I'm, I'm on the ferry of the damned. Right, I'm dead then. Um, if she, if I lead her a little way up the shore, shoot the cannons at me, and I will stand near her and you'll hit her. Won't They won't hurt members of your crew, but they will hurt her. Where are you going, Dave? I've got to find some food. There's a trader over here. There's food on the ship. Loads of food on the ship. too close to the shore. To yes, I know, but I mean, it's going back to the boat. She I keep getting X's every time I hit her. Yeah, I don't. Yeah, that means you are hitting her. I'll just keep sniping her for now. Oh, God's sake. Yep, yeah, we just got her in. Away with, I'll wait for the boat to dip. She's got no skeletons left either. It's just her. Skeletons. Yep, she's just gone underground. Looking for me. She's right here. Is there... she's right here. Do you think there might be a state that she's in when she becomes vulnerable? I'm out of cannon, so I need well, to get some more. Well, I thought because she was made of metal. Oh my god, she just blew me out to see. Because she was made of metal, she might rust, but... Mm. Food. Let me get back to the ship. That's where all the food is. We're not hitting Oops, she's too far in. Because there's no doubt we fired a lot of cannonballs at her. Surrender and I'll grant you. Or fire bombs? Is nobody taking fire bombs? No. No, just fire the fuck ton of cannibals at her. We don't know if they're doing having any any effect. Now stand still and die. Did you think I was alone? I never asked to be cursed. Still think you can win. I never asked to be cursed. Oh, that got that hurt, huh? That did as well. I'm using her fusion it because she drops the boat. I'm too fast for you. Damn it. <coughs> I'm wondering if we need to be shooting her with actually hitting her with a sword, you know. It's taking way too long. Hmm. Gonna make us rock. Wanted. Not bad for a fresh Now 
Stand still and die! Boy. Now stand still and die! Time to leave the odds! Today you have the honor of dying at the hands of Captain Briggsy! Not quick enough! She will go down, Liz. Looking for me? It will just take a hell of a hand and that's all. She will die. Today you have the honor of dying at the hands of Captain Briggsy! Right, where's she gone? Looking for me! Looking Over for here. me! There's nothing personal. Oh, no. I just really want to kill you. Oh, I'll see her. See who you're dealing with! Whoa! <laughs> Today you have the honor of dying at the hands of Axis Briggsy! <laughs> Food. Let me get some food. Someone can keep her in this yes. alcove here. Yes! Just dead, she's dead, she's dead. Thank fuck for that. Oldie should, <laughs> should go eventually. Oldie should go eventually. She's got herself trapped on that rock, so... Briggsy's skull. There we go, I've got it. Whoa! Elder should go eventually. Return to Madame Olivia at Thunder Outpost, and then that should, I hope. Please. Well, if it, if this if this doesn't give us the stone, we've got a checkpoint, so we can load to this point tomorrow night if mm -hmm. we haven't if we haven't done it. So that's handy. Um, we need to go back to Thunder Outpost. Let's check the full town and see what that says. I'm on the wheel. Oh, I'm we still on the island. Hard right on the thing. Do I do, have a look on the island to see if anything can nick? No, let's just go. Uh, it's, it's, it's a bit late. Let's just get out of that dodge. Okay. Do you want me to get this crate on the way past? Yeah. We've got a load of stuff on board to sell Is anyway, so uh, pull a hard well, right. Literally a, I'm already hard right. Literally on the way. Hello, handsome cat. Right, we have sails down. And I am on board. Right, let's get the anchor up then. Which direction are you really heading? Let's just get moving. Uh, I think it's south ish, but I'll check in a second. So we might want to pull right, get past this boat on our left, and then just turn left around the other end of the island. Okay. Yeah, we want to go around the island and then uh, under outpost is southwest. Aye, aye. <clears throat> Who's sleep that is? Probably the guy with the They were shot. on the island. Yeah, they, uh, they were on the island. Um, they brought a skull on board and James killed them. Yep, she didn't ask permission. <laughs> it's Mariner's etiquette to ask, ask permission to come aboard. They didn't ask permission, so I should yeah. kill them. They could have been Trespassers will be shot. And they made no effort of showing that Survivors will be shot again. Yep. So... Southwest. There we go. Okay. Yeah, that's a, that's about right. We're going to have a few islands between us and 
Thunder Outpost, but we can sort of weave our way around them. We've got um, Crypt's Hollow between us and Thunder Outpost. Okay. I'm hoping if we just get this back to Thunder Outpost, that is the end of uh, this part of Tall Tale. We have a stone. Um, Oh, it's really spooky music. Skeleton, skeleton ship. Oh, not again. Where? Whoa! I can't see a bloody thing. Someone's probably just pissing and dipping. I can't see it either. It's behind, behind us. It's behind you. Oh, yeah. oh my. Turn the Dave. Sonia, get on a sail each, get it to full sail. Let's just outrun it. We can't beat it. There's well, two it's, of them. It's in our the way to go There's, out of run it is to be to turn into them. Well go left. I think they're all on the go. Sail. Full sail. Let's full sail now. Pull us left. Just, yeah, just get us away from it. Okay. Just into the wind, just so you know. Well, yeah, okay. Just get us away from it. Water. Yeah, I'm, I'm repairing below. Oh shit, can somebody bail please, thank you. I'm bailing. It's just a long way to go to bail. Okay, right behind us. Yep, it's fine. They're turning away. That's how we do it they're in our neighbourhood, bitch! We run away! <laughs> yep, they're turning away. They, they want to stay and patrol their thing, so that's fine. We had to bump into something, didn't we? <clears throat> it was inevitable, though. Right, we uh, we need to go... Turn, we need to turn, otherwise we're going to hit that rock. Hard right. To the right. Left, 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 left. Oh my god, left. we're gonna hit. Left. I'm going under. Yeah, left. go left, go left, go left. I'm hard left. left. I can't go any hard further left. Okay. Yeah, that's fine. Down here. Just tickle it. Rock on the left. Right. No, we're clear. Rock on the on the left. Turn it straighten her up. Straighten up. That was close. They could have done with us power. as a Titanic ship. Right, uh, keep on this heading for a short while, James. And then, right, go <coughs> hard right if we can. Are we clear? Can we go hard right and head west? Yes. Head west. If we trim the cells to assist, that would be down. Once we're heading west. Southwest. Tell me when you want me to play with the sails. Easy tiger. Do not. Quite. Uh, Four points. Round about now. Yep, we should be. Dead on, and there are no islands, but then the rocks aren't on the map, so if there is anything else. Crow's nest. Cool. Oh, no, she jumped off the ship. The, the crow's nest has always looks like a ship in the distance.
this. Yeah, we should play this for quite a while, that's fine. Oh, you it's think we've gone south, James? No, we're going west. South west by southwest. I said exactly west, which So if we carried on, say, past the port, we could then go west and that would have us directly on course. We've drifted round to the left. More and then we need to go... No, we need to go northwest, now. Detour! You saved them. Yep, that's it. Head on. That is Plunder 8 post in front of us now. Okay, let's uh, reset the sails then. Is that going right to left? I'm going right to left. Left to right, right to yeah. left, yeah. Uh, we can't quite get full child, but... This is what we had. But it doesn't make any difference until it actually hits full sail. There we go, now we're full sail. And we're Although we need to go right, we need to... Yeah, we need to go... Yeah, that's the island there. We need to go right, we need to go right. I'm going right. Okay, uh, let's get the front and main sails up, please. There we go. Uh, and then pull a hard left one once we clear this. I think it's all <coughs> around the other side. There we I've go. I've got to make the anchor. Me. Right, I'll get the main set up. Oh. Computer screen. Right, tell Sonia when you want to drop the anchor games. Um, now. Right. I'll grab Briggsy's skull, let's get that sorted first, and then we'll sell our other bits. Oh, this is the end of it. Mm. Well, I've got a skull in my hand anyway, so... There's some sapphires on the... Yeah, I think, I think we've got... I think we've got two skulls, so if we grab them, we can take them all to the order. Oh. Might as well just sell that one, Sonia. Yep. Anybody bring the other skull? Mm-hmm. There's Dave. Dave's Dave. coming. Uh, no, I didn't think there was anything left for me to bring. There's two gems on the ship to yeah. sell. Well, yeah, we'll we'll sort the gems in a minute. I'm just, let's just get this full tail thing sorted first. Are we all at the Order of Souls? Where's it gone again? Where's it gone? I don't know. Right. 
Dreck. Waited years for this moment. So few people stop to wonder what the Order of Souls does with the bounties once we have them. Each skull holds many secrets. Memories of old hordes and old encounters long forgotten. If Briggsy truly did possess the Shroudbreaker, the missing pieces should lie somewhere within her recollection. But be warned, such visions are not always easy to interpret. Oh, brilliant. brilliant. Lucky we're clever then, isn't it? Nobody's home. A long life. There are many Ooh. memories to sift through, but I can make out a few names. Tasha, a girl in a tavern, staring in awe as the firelight flickers and great tales are told. Right, okay. A dear friend who threads his way across the wild oceans by the light of the stars. Of the light of the stars. Trembling before a blade, revealing the lair of a trickster. Wild rose, true love shining like a beacon that calls across the waves. Wild rose. Fate has bound you to meet with these wanderers, for they alone know of the precious stones you seek. I can offer you nothing more than my gratitude and faith that you have the strength to reach the shores of gold. Farewell. Okay. Oh, eight thousand. So, yeah, eight thousand pieces of gold. Um, basically, Jesus told us to find four people upon the seas of uh, upon the uh, Sea of Thieves. Mm -hmm. Tasha, Tasha, who's in a tavern. I'm assuming she's a barmaid in one of the um, in one of the taverns on one of the outposts. Mm -hmm. uh, we might as well we might as well collect our other treasure while we're um, while we're chatting this out. Uh, Suds by the light of the stars. I think Suds might be on one of the sea posts, one of the little seaports. I'm not sure. Salty. I have no idea where he is, and I have no idea where Wild Rose. Is. Wild Rose. I, Wild Rose was. Um, I think she is. Basically, the, the, she's one of two dead people, and we have to reunite their soul in order to find the location of one of the gems from the from the Shroud Breaker. Sounds easy. Yeah. Um, Where am I selling this mermaid gem? Uh, you can sell it in one of two places. You can sell it to the uh, the gold hoarder, or you can sell it I to the see. guy on. Yeah. So if you sell that one at the gold hoarder, I'll sell the I'll sell the other one at the trader on the dock. They can they can be sold at either wall. You'll get the same amount of gold. It's just you'll like, you'll get experience for both factions then. Do we have anything else aboard? I think that was it. There's an ammo crate. We can sell that even as possible. Well, that one you can move around. So you yeah, don't have but... to keep running downstairs temporarily. Yeah, yeah, but we're also now finishing for the night, so might as well sell it and get some money mm. for it. Fair enough. Um... I can't set the building. How was fire. that? He <laughs> throw you fire bombs. Tell the ammo crate. Gosh, she no, doesn't take it seriously, does she? Nope. Well, I found Tanya. It's not Tasha, though. Right. Okay. Yeah. I think I think Tasha is one of the barmaids in in the pub, and I'm not sure whether if you do. Um. You do the tall tail. 
whether she might tell you where the next one is. But we need to know where Tasha, which pub she's in. Um, leave it with me. I'll see if I can remember it because I did this before and I can't can't remember which pub she's in. I'm sure she's in Tasha in a tavern. That is what she said. Didn't she? Yes. Yeah, so she's in one of the pubs. But there's so many outposts. She could be at any of them. Right, okay. Let's wrap it up for the night. Um, we're not going to do Friday night for the next part. Uh, the next part we will do on Saturday night. So that's me signing that's off. That's half nine. Yeah, about, what, half nine on Saturday, yeah? Yeah, about then. Right, 9.30 on uh, Saturday, it's so 9.30 GMT plus one, British summertime. Late is all. Fair. Late is. <laughs> it's telling um, them late is. <laughs> yeah, I had a whole...